Oh, hello. What's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Some news for you. But before we do that, smash the likes, hit the subscribe button. Let's go. Well, Leicester have appointed a new manager, and the first bit of news for today, for Monday, uh, not don't know how to take this one to be honest with you. It's coming through from One Football. Big shout out to One Football. Is this bad boy here, Wilfred Ndidi? Apparently, the Saudis are coming in for him, and it's thirty-five million pound bid. Apparently, I'll read it out to you. I'll get your thoughts on it in the comments. I want to hear what your thoughts are on this one. Saudi Arabia Professional League Club Al Shabab have established contact with Wilfred Ndidi over a potential move this summer. Ndidi is among the high profile players expected to leave Leicester City following the Foxes' relegation from the Premier League. <sighs> they have to keep reminding us, don't they? According to the Egyptian journalist Ash <laughs> Ashmad Rigab, Al Shabab has. Oh God has engaged in formal discussions with the midfielder regarding a summer move. What is with Saudi Arabia at the minute with coming all these bloody players, Kante and uh, the Benzimas and stuff? It's just, go, it's just never ending. It remains to be seen whether the 26-year-old will be keen on a move to a less competitive but lucrative Sunday league. I'd be going. I'd be going. I'd be gone. I'd be gone. <laughs> if Saudi Arabia got a Royal Mail over there, <laughs> hit me up. I'm a good poster. Honestly, it <laughs> just hit me up. I'll take 100 grand a week. <laughs> Fuck you know. I'll take whatever he's being paid. I don't know what he's being paid over there. I don't know what he's being offered, but surely it's going to be something ridiculous like 400 grand a week or something stupid. It's going to be. It's, uh, hands up. Would you take a job over Saudi? <laughs> You're earning money for your grandkids, grandkids, grandkids. Anyway, going back to it, a lucrative Saudi league at this stage of his career. Al Shabab, who once had former Super Eagles forward uh, Odion Igalo on their books, have won Saudi league six times. The Lions won their last title, though, in 2012. They finished in fourth position last season. Right, so look, it's not competitive. It's not really what you'd want at 26 years old. It's something you probably want at like 32, 31, 32 maybe and get that big fat paycheck because you're not really going to win anything that's prestigious enough to gloat about. Uh, but Wilfred Ndidi lives, Rofley, I won't say what number. I, I know where, he, where his house is. He's got an house in, in Rofley. I've uh, delivered to it for a few times. Never said hello. No, I'm joking. He's, he's never there. Um, but... I'd go, mate. Just go. Just go. Honestly, you look, you've done what you've done at Leicester. It's 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 worked out okay. You won an FA Cup, done half decent in the Champions League, blah, 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 blah. Unfortunately, the injury that you suffered, I think, has altered his career path. I don't think he's the NDD he was. I think, go, boy, go. Go and get that paycheck. We're all happy for you if you go. We don't mind. We're not going to... We're not going to be upset. We're not going to be, you know, just go. Go for it. Go and collect the bag. That's what I think anyway. Let me know in the comments, though, what you think Ndidi should do. Should he stay? Should he go? Should Leicester check, check in that £35 million pounds that, that apparently is being thrown about on Twitter and thanks to now one football as well? Or do you think we hold on to Ndidi for the championship? Because, God, we need players. We've let Mendy go. Who's going to be CDM? At this point, I know that Hamza Chowdhury is going to probably end up coming back into that hole. Uh, and KDH can potentially play that style. So, But all in all, I think <laughs> if we're going to sell most of our players, by the looks of it, are, are going like Barnes and Madison, just to name a few. Uh, Dennis Pratt looks like set to go Torino as well, which is another video I should have done. But, you know, we'll probably just cover that on a short another time. Um, Ndidi here. 26, still got a fair few years, could potentially play for Leicester for another few years. Let me know in the comments what your thoughts are on this one. Right, guys, I shall see you very, very soon. Keep up to date on the channel for more 
make sure you smash the like on the video, hit the subscribe button as usual, leave a like, you know, and go and follow me on socials, I am at Lee on Scott Chappie, uh, all my socials are in the description of the video, that it is for today, shall see you on the next one, see you in a bit.